Hi guys, today we're looking at the Tipman Stormer Elite. So this is a fairly new gun from um, Tipman, very similar to the Kronos. It's got an inline blowback system, so same as the 98. So this system goes way, way back, same as the TMC. Let's open the box. So you've got the mag fed part of the gun already fitted. You've got a nice grip there. I think you're gonna need it with a marker that sort of length. So 98 threaded barrel. Same as the TMC, put this handguard on. So again, this is, um, body is all high grade polymer. Really, really nice. Got a nice rubber grip. You've got your ASA on the bottom here. Got very simple push safety, works. So when the red indicator is exposed, it's ready to fire. When it's not, it's not. You got a cocking handle here. What you will need to do with the uh, Stormer is before you add any CO2 or air to it, you co cock it back, you get the bolt in the firing position. If the bolt's forward and you put air or CO2 onto the ASA at the bottom, you will get air coming through the front of the gun. So make sure the bolt's in the firing position before you you load it. So in the box, just go through the box quite quickly, you've got your barrel uh, bag or barrel condom. You have a stock. We're not going to be using that today. It's really, really simple to fit. I'll just show you quickly. This is a rubber cap comes off the end, slides from the bottom to the top, and you've just got in here, you've got a small grub screw, hex key screw, that just keeps it in place but we're not gonna use that today. You get two mags with it. What you don't get is this here, which is just a, an attachment. So you can keep the mags together. That's something you get in a, in a dual pack of these. Again, similar to the TMC, exactly the same mags, so they're cross compatible. Just a wind up mag. It's got a spring in it, a soft spring, so it's most suitable for paintball. We're gonna try firing it with rubber rounds, see what happens. The 20 round magazines, so 20 paintballs only. Don't try and be greedy and cram more in there than that. You cause yourself problems. Right, let's put rubber rounds in this one. Again, just wind it up. Don't overwind it, don't over tension it. Cause yourself all sorts of problems. If you are using, gonna try and use rubber rounds, then in a mag fed system, then we suggest you always oil them up before you use them. So. Let's put them in there, 20 go in there. Let's put these back together. Let's load it up. Make sure our safety's on. Should really keep that on as well. That is a Stormer Elite ready to fire some paintballs and rubber rounds. Before we do that, if you've enjoyed this video so far, if you can give us some encouragement by giving us a thumbs up, that'd be great. And if you want to see more videos like this, um, or you want to take a look back at some of the videos we've done previously, then if you could subscribe and hit the notifications, that'd be great. So let's shoot this. Let's see what it can do. So we've just shot the Storm Relief, and as you can tell by the smile on my face, it performed brilliantly. Um, you know, first few shots out of the out of the box, the velocity was a little bit low. We adjusted that, we put it up, and, and at the target 50 feet, I know 50 feet isn't isn't a huge distance, but 50 feet it was hitting the target in the right place almost every single time. Didn't have any breaks, didn't have any mishaps. The springs in the mags aren't really suitable for rubber rounds, but this is a paintball marker, so you know. Let's be shooting the, the right ammo through it. One thing I missed earlier was it comes with these quite nice flip up sights. So fitted the fitted one on there, haven't fitted the other, and they just like they're just really really simple. Um, which is a which is a really nice feature. It's coming in at a good price for a paintball gun. It allows you to play all styles of paintball. Um, scenario or mag fed, you can go hopper, you can go mag. 
you're not you can't fire um, first strikes from it, but firing paintballs is 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 accurate at 50 feet. Um, I would imagine it goes well beyond that. We didn't have the capacity to shoot any further than that, but very very impressed with what we were able to do. Um, yeah, and it's comes in less around about probably 200 bucks, 200 euros, 200 pounds there or thereabouts. And it's great budget MagFed Mark. I, I, I think if you're looking to start um, paintball and you want to play all styles, then this, this ticks all the boxes. If I were to recommend anything, it would probably be, probably be this. I think, it's a, I think it's a cracking piece of kit. Really, really good. Again, reliable inline blowback system, tried and tested. It's worked for years. Uh, you can fling these things with that system in there, in a bag, and you can pick it out of the bag a year, even longer than that later, and it's still working. As the, you know, you can't, you can't really fault that. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and keep your eyes peeled for the next one.